definitely didn't work. Yeah, I can see that. <laughs>what it is what it do is your boy captain farmer back to react to i guess a re-release of the final fantasy 7 mission abridged by team four star team four star came out with this one a couple years back uh after they finished dragon ball z abridged which i'm sure most if not all of you guys are familiar with uh, i need an adult i am an adult <laughs> they've apparently condensed this into a 40 minute movie which is i guess a lot more Digestible. I'm a huge Final Fantasy 7 fan, so I'm going to love this either way, I'm sure. Guys, if you are new here, I do reactions, reviews, and just dope commentary on all types of content. So, to not miss out, please hit the like and subscribe button. Follow me on Instagram at your own leisure on both my personal and business pages. Got my cup full of, uh, you know what? Time to crack into this bad boy. Are you starting this off in the middle? Three days. That's how long we got until Meteor flans the f out of us. Holy bejewels. That's like 504 hours. Dark math. It took me a long time to get those tomatoes off me. Any of you said your goodbyes? Yeah. Dropped by Rocket Town and uh me and Shira had a heart to heart. Going to save the planet. Don't know when I'll be back. Unicorn nights on Wednesday. Good love, you science bitch! I also said my goodbye for now to Molly. I even told her about her father, Don. Yay! I have two dads! When do I get to meet him? As for me, I hired some pals to acquire our ultimate weapon. Wait! Are you telling me that the best test -tes -tes weapons we have can become even? Best test -tes 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 couldn't have said it better myself. Did somebody say, I sure wish Yuffie was here? I can say for certainty that no one has ever <laughs> said that. Got a little update, skis, my dudes. I like Yuffie. I got all the materia! Even the one that turns you into frogs! That's great, Yuffie. So, uh, now that that's all done, you think you maybe want to use the time we have left to have a talk with a certain someone? Oh, I mean, I did want to tell Vincent he's got a cute butt, but I think I'm over him now. She's talking about your dad, Yuffie. Oh! Now I'm good. Yuffie, you can't just ignore him forever. You see, as a father myself... You understand that not everyone's parental situation is the same as yours, and thus you know you shouldn't be giving unsolicited advice when you have zero context? In other words, don't dad explain me. Thank you, Yuffie. Wow, I shall Yuffie. take this L and grow. <laughs> Look, Yuff, if you don't want to see him, that, that's totally fine. But we only have three days left. 504 dog hours. And the window for you to say anything you want to him is closing fast. Anything, huh? All right, I'll go. But only if you and Cloud come with me, okay? Of course we will, Yuffie. How could I say no to what will most definitely be an extremely awkward conversation? And while y'all doing that, it's the perfect time for Sid, Red, and myself to initiate Operation... It's got Avalanche in the name, doesn't it? No! Yes. All right, everyone. Let's use this time wisely. Remember, we've only got three days. 504 hours. Okay, so no one's gonna say those numbers don't... Dog man! Nay. Nice. Sup, Crustnuts. Hey, it's my favorite ninja daughter, Riku. Yuffie! Shufi, right. <laughs> Riku. Sorry, I'm still kind of waking up. It's 4.07 p.m., dude. Hey, only got 13 minutes till... <laughs> you know. So, Goto, I don't know if you've looked up at anything that wasn't your tie-dyed mirrored ceiling recently, but there is a giant meteor headed toward the planet. Bummer. And with the limited amount of days that we have, there are a few things that Yuffie, your daughter, would like to say to you. Yuffie? Bite me. Okay, that's <laughs> Goto, is there anything you'd like to say to Yuffie? You know what? There is. Did I borrow 50 gil? I took some green from this chick's garden and now her and a four-year-old are threatening to pop my kneecaps if I don't pay them back. You are unbelievable. If it's outside, that means it's free. That's like the law, man. You know what? There is something I want to say. 
You are a lazy, selfish, good-for-nothing moocher of a father! <laughs> you just called me father. I win! That's not how this works. <laughs> and another thing! That leather jacket you bought doesn't make you look young at all. You take that the f*** back. You're such a goddamn yeah, well, dead So, what do you think Barrett and the others are doing? Uh, whatever it is, I guarantee you it's nowhere near as scary as this. <sighs> Finding Bahama? Hey, what's up? I'm Bahama. <laughs> oh, great and powerful dragon god Bahamut! This is fucking stupid. Shut the f*** up, I'm graveling! We come seeking your strength. Please accept this humble offering. You know the way to our grandma's house? We made her cookies! <laughs> oh, you're gonna die. Yep. What the f***? <laughs> Holy shit! Yeah! <laughs> Talk shit about Bahamut and see what happens! Sephiroth don't stand a chance. Hey, whoa, 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 Sephiroth? Like giant sword, silver hair, planet destroying, sexy yeah. guy Sephiroth? Yeah, that's the one. All those things are accurate, <laughs> yeah. Superb accurate. Wait, how the f do you know him? Uh, you know we summon C and talk about everything that's been going down, right? Ooh, a different like. I bet he has angry issues. Hey, he's getting better. <laughs> so what? Wow. Can, can help us? Hey, look, if you got a mid-high monster that needs taken care of, I'm your dragon. But final boss shit? Nah, dude. That ain't Wow, happening. he's gonna whistle. Well, what, what about Neo Bahamut? Nope. Bahamut Zero? Still no. Nope. Mudfuls Behengers? Assembling to say no. Ball and Wonder Behold. Every moment is an adventure to say no. Bahamut Cross the New Horizons? <laughs> Staying inside. Bahamut Segway? Oh, that's just lazy. Family Bloodline Tessie! Yo, can I do that? Nah, it's gives a generation. God There's damn so it, much. guys! Fighting isn't Easter going eggs. to resolve anything. There's so much Who references to I'd be the real to series. Resolve things if my dad didn't act like a lazy, selfish asswipe. Well, maybe if my daughter didn't constantly see me as a bad guy, I'd be willing to sit down and have a conversation. Well, maybe I'd also be willing to have a conversation if there was a way where we weren't constantly at each other's throats. Well, maybe I know a way we could do that. Fine. How? You ever notice? Oh wow. Our <laughs> hands look like blocks. <laughs> I don't remember this in the real game, but uh, I wish they did it. Um, I mean, it smells to me like it's working. Yeah. We're getting a thousand Chokunagis after this, right? No. Two thousand. <laughs> hey, Dad. I'm sorry about... Don't you go apologizing. You're right. I laid back and I let Wu-Tai turn into... into this. Maybe I was wrong to stop fighting. If you didn't, Shinra would have wiped us all out. You did what you thought was right and saved countless lives. But now that they're gone, maybe we can start over? On better terms? I'd like that. Just make sure you beat that punk Sephiroth first. Uh, yeah, yeah, don't worry. We're totally gonna smoke him. <laughs> <laughs> nice. I don't get it. Ultimate for foul? Ruined my childhood. Ball rolls too? Will be hurt? Too busy destroying mass viewings. The hell am I tag face the behusic? Absolutely no. The rise of. All right! So what you're telling me is that neither you nor the billions of other Bahamuts or whatever the fks can help us? I believe the number is Bahillions. Look, we know how it goes. You guys get in a little trouble, then you call one of us, and nine times out of ten, we get the job done. But there comes a point when we're just not strong enough. And the only ones that can take down threats like Sephiroth are yourselves. You really think so? It's not a god's job to save the world. It's yours. So for gods believe in ourselves. Got it. Thank you, Muhammad. You have shown us that you are as wise as you are handsome. And you are really handsome. <laughs> shucks, fellas. But if you did want some extra firepower, there is a summon. With enough strength, nice of the rounds. That might I remember just that be one. enough to defeat Sephiroth. But in order to obtain it, you must endure a grueling trial. What do you say? What do we say? Avalanche time. Avalanche time. <sighs> Avalanche time. 
So what do we gotta do? So you're gonna wanna use an aphrodisiac or curio greens to really sift the mood. Uh, and don't forget, foreplay is key. So how's your guys think? The last the case. case. I hope you don't mind that Yuffie brought her dad here to hang out for a bit, Sid. The second he found out this ship was called the High Wind, there was nothing we could do. What's this button do? Get the phone. I'd be a monster if I didn't. Hey, hey, guess what, folks? I just got word from my buddies that we're good to go grab our ultimate weapon! That's awesome! Who did you hire to grab our weapons anyway? Hey, buddy. Uh, f***ing Chris. Just a heads up, Cloud. I ain't doing fight buddies right now. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. The Turks? Why? They work for Shinra? Worked for Shinra. Just thought the least an ex-Shinra like me could do is help out another ex-Shinra, right? Oh, yeah. I guess now that they're gone, that makes you all... Unemployed in a broken economy where we have to take odd jobs to pay for basic living expenses that we can barely afford? Yeah, it f***ing sucks! I share a room with the mop! I've developed an addiction to an extremely complex card game. I've collected so many shiny Xehanorts. Jeez. What about Sung? How's he been holding up since the Temple of the Ancients? Welcome to another episode of Final Fanfic Sexy. <laughs> Tonight's episode is titled the Mughal <laughs> in Yugo. Legit, it has over 500,000 plays. A corner Ooh, of those are mine. And half of those are mine. So, you got the stuff? Yep, just like you asked. Everyone's ultimate weapon. Sick! Except for clouds. I'll make sure to transfer the payment as soon as possible. Your Shin Pal email is still open, shirthottie69 at shinmail.com, right? Don't worry about it. This one's on the house. But look, real talk. We're sorry and about everything. We know this doesn't make up for what we've done, but you gotta start somewhere, right? You're right. It doesn't make up for everything. You all have to live with the consequences of what you did to Sector 7. And it's gonna be a long, uncomfortable walk before things are even remotely chill with us. But this is a start. Thanks. Can you go save the motherfucking world, please? That's the plan. So, about my ultimate weapon? In order to get my ultimate weapon, we need to kill the ultimate weapon. Ultimate weapon. I thought ultimate weapon was the weapon Scarlet used. No, that was an ultimate weapon she made as an ultimatum. So that would make this ultimate weapon the ultimate weapon of pure ultimacy. Ultimately, yes. Why the f are you like this? I have returned. Vincent! So, just to bring you up to speed, everyone except for me got their ultimate weapons. We even got yours! A bigger gun. Groovy. So where the f**k's your vampire ass been? Celebrating Hojo's ass stopping? Hey, remember guys, he's not a vampire, but he is full of spiders. Can we just... Can we not, please? <laughs> One would think that after Hojo's demise, I would feel an immediate sense of jubilation. But I knew that I could not allow myself to feel this heightened sense of euphoria just yet. I began scouring the world. And after all this time, after 30 years, I have finally found my love, Lucrezia. Vincent, how long has it been since that fateful day? 30 years, my love. 30 years of slumbering in a coffin with nothing but the spiders I adopted into my body and the thoughts of torture I would induce to Hojo. I have searched this planet to bring you joyous news that those thoughts, those nightmares are over, and Hojo is no more. Oh, Vincent, you are owed every star in the sky for what Hojo and I put you through. That is why I have damned myself to this underwater crystal cavern as punishment for the sins I have committed against you and all of humanity. I helped create that monster, Sephiroth. And I will help destroy him and absolve you of your sins. Vincent. Wow, that's beautiful, Vincent. Once I get my ultimate weapon, we should, we will be strong enough to defeat Sephiroth. Now we just have to find it. The ultimate weapon or your ultimate weapon? Yes. Perhaps I should have asked that giant floating dragon as I was leaving Lucretius if they had seen anything like that. Oh, wait. Which Bahamut is that one? That's no Bahamut. That's the ultimate weapon! All right, everyone! Attack! How? Throw something at it! No, 
my gateway to Shiva's garden. Why the f are you still here? I forgot where I live. Don't worry, guys. I'll use Soldier Bolt and... Did it... Did it just fly away? No! This is not a victory! Ultimate weapon, the next time we meet, we'll be prepared to fight you in aerial combat! It's on the ground, man. Yeah, I can see that! Quick, Barret, shoot it! Eat that soup, fake ass, Muhammad, motherfucker! It didn't work. Yeah, I can see that! <laughs> Found you! Wrong weapon. I remember how annoyed this was. We got this. We did not got that. <laughs> so we've been spending five hours trying to find this bitch. I've always say f*** it and just go kill Sephiroth. No! If we're gonna fight Sephiroth, all of us need to be in our strongest gear. Now let's think. What's the one place we haven't checked? You know, it's times like this that I'd give myself a big old think and ask, what would Grandpa Bugenhagen do? That's it! The one place we haven't been to yet! The ancient forest! Just you wait, Ultimate Weapon. We're gonna find you no matter how long it takes. I don't think the ultimate weapon is here, Cloud. <sighs> All right. Guess we'll still keep looking. He was behind us. Oh, <laughs> son of a bitch! Oh, wow. What? You're gonna fly away this, again? This is the Make us spend hours trying to find thing. you? Well, well, go ahead. Keep flying away. Because I'm never gonna stop. Not until I defeat you. Didn't you have to fight in the water, too? Or was that something planet? else? Oh, so that's why you won't fight us. <laughs> Hold up, Brett. Since when could you understand World Protecting Dragon? I took a night class. Ice weapons only fight those that are threats to the planet. And after observing all you have done, I have come to the conclusion that you are all not threats, but saviors. Yo, was that a low-key burn? Yeah, you know, <laughs> yeah. yeah. For displaying a fierce drive and a never-give-up attitude, I, Ultimate Weapon, award to you your Ultimate Weapon. Ultima Weapon. That's unsurprising. <sighs> Thank you for this. We won't fail. I know you won't. Because you can't. Farewell. Holy shit! Well, y'all, it looks like all the planet's weapons have been defeated. What about Ruby and that All one? the weapons have been defeated! <laughs> you know, yeah, that was something since else. we are right by Cosmo Canyon... You wanna visit, Grandpa? Yeah! Nanaki, wait! Oh no. Hey, something wrong? Yeah, it's Bugenhagen. And then Yuffie and her dad fixed their relationship through the magic of greens. Then my best as friend Barrett talked to Bahamut. And then Vincent talked to his baby dad almost girlfriend. And then I got to talk to a quadrupedal dragon. Isn't that cool, Grandpa? <laughs> Grandpa? Yes, Nanaki. It is most cool. Nanaki was such Anaki, a more badass name I... than. Red 13. I need to go soon. Wait, where are you going? On another journey to become one with the planet. Uh, oh. Well, once we beat Sephiroth, we can come pick you up. Nanaki. And then we'll bring you back to Cosmo Canyon where, where you can live and make everyone happy. Grandpa, I didn't want you to go. Do not be sad, Nanaki. This is a journey we all must take eventually. And even though I will be gone, I will be the wind that guides you towards greatness, the ground that helps you stand tall, and the light that brightens your day. Now, go and save the planet. Save that theme song, man. Hope. Just be hitting you right in the, in the chest. Underrated theme. Red 13 has a very underrated theme song. Off oh, another beauty now. Red, I, I, I'm so sorry. If only we had come here sooner. It's okay. I'm just glad I got to speak with him one last time. Everyone's time comes eventually, right? All right. Guess that wraps it up. Set a course to the northern crater. We're going to kick Sephiroth's ass. Tomorrow. We end this tomorrow. Oh, oh, tomorrow. Oh, tomorrow. Oh, tomorrow. Huh? I know, the window's tight. But we've been going non-stop since Midgar. I think taking a couple hours off to clear our heads will be good for us. 
whatever you say, leader. Sid, there's some place I'd like to visit. Hey, crazy, right? The stuff we've been through, the stuff we've seen. Nibelheim breaking out after five years of Hojo experimenting on us, making it to Midgar, <laughs> where we met some of the weirdest, loudest, cursiest ragtag group of adventurers ever. <laughs> the shit we went through. We went through robots, went through explosions, went through a roof, and then landed on a bed of flowers and met her. She changed both our lives. I don't think I would have gotten this far if it wasn't for you. For all of you. My family. I love you all. And I know you all love me too. You all love me so much, in fact, you're willing to risk your lives and journey with me to the center of the planet where we either save all this, or I let everyone down and we die. The planet dies. Her memory dies. Whenever I was unsure or her memory no way to do, always had my back. And I feel so selfish for asking. But I need you. Cause I'm scared. I'm so fucking scared. Tell me what to do. Just tell me what to do. Morning, sleepyhead. Dang, dude, you're out like a light. Well, you didn't get enough like sleep a light. after five years? Like a light. Well, don't you worry your pretty blonde spiky head. I'm sure I can do more than enough talking for the both of us. That soldier suit looks great on you, by the way. Shame we couldn't wash it first. And one soldier squad. Two soldier squad. <laughs> if you soldier need a place squad. to crash, I know someone in Midgar. She lives with her mom, though. Don't worry, she's chill. Maybe too chill. Five years. Man, she's gonna flip when she sees me again. What about you, Cloud? You got a girl back home? Maybe someone you did all this for? T her? Dang, she was a badass. Really into dolphins, but hey, we all got our things. She'd be proud of you. I failed to get in the soldier. Dude, you beat Sephiroth, the guy in soldier. Pretty sure that gets you your certificate. So many guys join for selfish reasons. Only wanting strength and power so they can push around the weak. But you and me, we joined because we wanted that strength and power to help others. That's what it means to me to be a first class soldier. But more importantly, to me, that's what it means to be a. Nice. Oh, wow. Not even gonna waste any bullets on him. It's just got dark. Cloud, you okay? Just remembering you. I'm. Can we talk? The breeze is nice. Yeah. You never realize how good something feels until it could be gone. Yeah. I'm worried. I know we got our best gears and our best skills, and metaphorically, it feels like our health and magic are maxed out, but mm -hmm. that doesn't ease the fact that this is it. We missed this shot. We won't. With you, me, and everyone else, we can do this. We can do anything. Hey, spoken like a first class soldier. Nah, I think I'm done calling myself that. 
Thinking back, Soldier was nothing more than a sword that Shinra used to cut down anything they wanted. Using your strength to help others, that doesn't make you a first-class soldier. It makes you a hero. Cloud, I... Uh, I'd like to try something, um, if you're comfortable with it. Oh? What did you have in mind? This is nice. Yeah. We should probably head back. Give me a solid. Just five more minutes. Okay? All right. I miss her. Me too. You guys fuck yeah! <laughs> They are maxed out. Ready? Yeah. Let's do this. This is so bad. Ow! Don't bad at all. Shut the fuck up. Can we go kill Sephiroth now? That's the calamity from the sky! Genova. That's what nearly wiped out the Setch race. Think we can take them? I know we can. We're not gonna be taken out by some damn virus! Now go back to the stars! That was easy. Did you just launch that bitch into space? Fucking right I did. <laughs> Perhaps the deepest pits of despair. Looks more like the center of the planet. I like his thing more. That light. That has to be. Holy shit! Sephiroth! What the f? Cool! I'm floating! This is the furthest thing from cool! It's like he's controlling us! I bet he can't control us if we all. Attack it once! <laughs> okay, that didn't work. <laughs> Holy. It's calling to us. It needs. To be freed. We've come too far. We can't give up now. We have to stop him. For the planet. For her! Get ready, Sephiroth. It's time to break all limits. Hey, Cloud, got you. This guy killed my fucking dad. Oh shit, he did. This two-faced, yellow-bellied motherfucker straight up killed my fucking dad. You sound pretty pissed. I'm very pretty pissed. You gonna beat the fuck out of him? I'm gonna beat the fuck out of him. <laughs> Do it. Let's fucking go. Let's fucking go. Let's fucking go. <laughs> Use your top leg. <laughs> so that's what a dolphin blow looks like. This is for my dad. This is for my town. And this is for my bar. Holy stromboli! How'd you lift that bitch up? <laughs> Hey, Beast Mode, do you know where Barrett went? Chick tock goes the clock. Who's bringing justice, sucker? Y'all know who it is. Evelyn's time! Mother f***er! <laughs> you just, just got to be gone and shoot a bunch of stuff, huh? <laughs> yeah. This is it. This is our chance. It's over, Sephiroth! You're right. Uh, yeah, is there music? Oh, yeah. It's over for everyone, for everything. It's all over for you. That's why you think Red Toss Me Knights of the Round. You got it. <laughs> that there works. thousand years ago with a purpose with a meaning to end the Cetra because she knew she had seen it before from the other planets she had liberated 
Like the many she had encountered, she knew the Cetra would eventually turn against each other. They would become greedy, hateful, cruel. The Cetra would become human. The planet cried, and she answered. Genova was not a calamity. She was a godsend. She was sealed away before her word could cleanse this filthy planet. But now I, her son, shall continue in her place, save this world from itself, and rule it as its god. For the long attack. Come on. Why do you continue to fight? The cruelty of humans needs to be extinguished. You're right. Humans are cruel. But humans are capable of more than that. They're capable of compassion. Change. Protecting. Learning. Teaching. Helping. Forgiving. Dream. Humans are capable of good. If that's what you truly believe, then let that be your final Haha! <laughs> I made that joke. Don't care. He's messing them up. They max out HP and he's messing them up. Where's Omni Slash at? Oh, whoa! What? What did you do? There we go. Omni. Oh, no, wait. It... Not yet. No. Then Cloud fights him one on one. Hey guys, did we just or not. kill God? Looked more like a one-winged angel if you ask me. More importantly, did we stop Meteor? Not sure. Guess only time will tell. All right, let's go. Did everyone see me flip my gun a bunch of times? <laughs> oh, yeah, 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 I hope what we did was enough. <laughs> Cloud? No. Cloud, what's wrong? He's, he's still... Cloud! There we go. You're still alive. You cannot stop fate. Well, I'm still willing to try. I'll keep going. Until you're nothing more than a memory. Oh, Cloud. I will never... Be a memory. This is the end. Yeah. Yours. Who the hell do you think you are? Hey! There we go. I'm the slash never gets old to look at. Shirtless dude, you know how it goes. Hey, where is everyone? Need a ride? Daddy? Ah! <laughs> <laughs> wow. Molly is definitely not to keep you talking like that. What the hell? 
now. But why isn't it working? Mistress friend, we're too late. Life stream. Life stream. When I hear the planet speak, it tells me how sad it is with how we treat both it and each other. It wishes we can all come together as one. It's up to us to change things and to make our home a place of love and acceptance. Because if we don't, our home will be gone forever. Do good. Be good. For those who are, who were, and who have yet to be. For our home. That was great. I thought this was actually gonna be like the full series in one movie, but I guess this was the second part of the Mission Bridge series, so. Guys, if you are interested in me reacting to the first part of the series, let me know. Otherwise, definitely leave me your thoughts in the comments below. Give this video a like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next one.